Hey guys, it's Lenny and welcome back to the channel. So today in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to get treasure maps on Red Dead Online. Now with the update fast approaching, this method is the best method to make money and gold on this game. Now, generally it is a grind to do anything on this game, but with this method, you guys should be able to get yourself some treasure maps and make enough money to at least um, get the new content. All right, so basically going to be glitching the treasure hunter or the treasure map or tree to spawn in every time. Now you want to have your MTU setting on PlayStation around about the 750 to 850 mark. I have to set mine to 850. Okay, so I spawn into a solo, solo session, sorry, and I'm not lagging out of that session and I do not spawn in with anyone else. In the description is also a website that you guys can check out. It is a awesome little tool in Red Dawn as well with other stuff with legendary animals and also there will be a collector map um, link as well. You guys can check that out. So I'm using the location in Valentine near Citadel Rock. All right, so I'm in Valentine and I ride to the back of Valentine and I'm sort of facing back towards the town itself and I'm going to reposition my map in the Heartlands. Okay, so I'm going to just change the bayou first, go to side location and change it back to the Heartlands. All done correctly in the correct position. Well, this is the position I use is near Citadel Rock. So I'll press pause and I'll show you. Um, so if you face back towards Valentine there, you press that your map in the Heartlands, it will should spawn in around this area. Now this is the best location I've found to do this. Um, there is other places as well as station, maps on trees, there's all different places. But you're contending with spawning in the Treasure Hunter and you're contending with spawning in the random online activity that could be happening at that time. So once you've done that, um, make your way over to your camp. Just make sure that you hang out here for a couple of minutes make some food, eat some food, whatever. Um, just give the, the game time to register that you're in this location. This is where your camp is. So when you spawn back in, that you'll spawn into this location here. So from here, you wanna go back to story mode. Now this is what I do just to make sure that my game actually registers me closing out of it and the camp spawns in the back at the same time. Once you've done that, um, close out of Red Dead, then go back to Red Dead. Open up the Red Dead application. From here, um, go to online and you want to spawn into your camp. Okay, so every time you come back online, you must select camp. Do not go anywhere else, just always select camp. Once you spawn in, um, basically within the um, game with treasure hunters and treasure maps on trees, they spawn in after, after a certain amount of time. Now, I am not 100% sure if the 72 hours is correct where the treasure hunters and treasure maps on trees spawn in. But um, for me, it's, yeah, after a day or so, I usually get them spawning. Sometimes I get two maps spawning in one night, so honestly, I don't know. But these things spawn in every so often. Um, you just have to work out when that is for you. Now, you can see where my camp is. The red markers are where the treasure hunters will spawn in. Um, I do have 10 maps already. I don't show that, but um, within the afternoon that I did this the other day, I managed to fill my map inventory up and I managed to start opening up the Citadel Rock map up and then collecting it again and then coming back online and repeating the process. I got up to 32 gold and then I stopped doing it after that. So, but now we're gonna get started with it. Okay, so from here, when you're at your camp there, just make your way around the right hand side of Citadel Rock. Okay, um, I generally just don't ride too fast. Just give the treasure hunter a chance to spawn in. Um, you can see there I'm in a session by myself, so my MTU setting is perfect. I'm not lagging out of the session and no one else is with me. And you can see there the little white dot on the map, that's the treasure hunter spawning in. Alright, so that's perfect, that's exactly what we need. And we're just going to make our way over here. Now I'm at the point where I'm collecting the maps. Once you've collected all the maps, you can basically open the Citadel Rock map and collect the gold and then recollect the Citadel map again from the Treasure Hunter, close up and then do that part again when you come back online. But for me, I'm just collecting all the maps now. So I have my 29 maps in my inventory. So you see him there, sometimes it's a girl, sometimes it's a boy. Um, sometimes they drop the map, sometimes they put the map away, you'll have to loot it from their body. But what we're trying to do here is basically close application after we have collected the map. Okay, and because of our MTU settings low, it's not going to give the game enough time to save that we're actually interacting with treasure map, but it's going to give us enough time to save it in our inventory, if that makes sense. All right, so I'm going to walk over to old mate, I'm going to shoot him, and I'm going to collect the map. Now, it's pretty easy once you get him to spawn in, just kill him. 
or her and then just pick up the map as soon as you pick up that map and you see it on your right hand side of your inventory on your on your screen you want to close application so that's the benedict map that i just got close application once you go back to your playstation dashboard you want to go into your settings and once you're in your settings you want to go down to date and time okay so once you're in date and time you want to go into the date and time settings and what we're going to be doing is changing the month okay so set manually and then what you want to do okay it'll be on whatever month you're on so at the moment we're in the seventh month i'm going to click back to the sixth month month sorry and accept it make sure you x this make sure you accept it as soon as you accept it, it'll take you back to the main to manually part back out of that and then go to red dead on red dead again application and make sure that you always select camp when you're coming back online so with the issues i have with recording i couldn't record the footage where i can show you all my maps because it just didn't save sometimes so i do apologize for that but um i managed to get this treasure hunter to spawn in the next three three times as you can see here he spawned in again um and i collected it about three or four maps i believe and um the save the travelers like spawned in which is another it's the random activity that spawns in just behind it but as you can see there he spawned back in again um so this is showing you that this is what happens okay so you'll spawn in and then you'll go to go where the treasure map hunter will be and that random activity there which is to save those travelers okay so what all you have to do when that happens is basically the same thing as if you were to collect it on a map all right which is close application change your month so either take it back to the previous month or bring it back to the current month accept it and then come back online again okay that might happen once could happen four or five times in a row but eventually what will happen is that it will spawn back in as the treasure hunter and you continue on collecting maps so this is the point here where i've actually collected every map that's in the game okay which is i counted 29 um i thought that was 30 but i only counted 29 so on the 29th map um i have everything so what you do here this is the part where we start making money and gold while collecting the map that we just opened all right so we're going to open the citadel rock map in a moment but um i'm going to just make sure that that treasure hunter spawns in first okay so in a sec here just gonna hop on my horse make my way over to the right hand side of citadel rock um <clears throat> and then yeah open the treasure map up once we realize that that treasure hunter is there now what will happen every second time after when you're doing this process when you come back to a session to redo the steps again that map will still be open okay that treasure map will still be open even though you collected it just before always make sure that you reopen that citadel rock map again so it refreshes because if you don't and you go and collect the gold that was the map that was already open you'll pretty much stuff up your process and you'll have to wait for this treasure hunter to respawn in okay so just make sure if that happens to you just reopen the citadel rock map up after you locate the treasure hunter like i have here just reopen it up just so it refreshes it and then you can continue on with the process so i mean my in my satchel i say the interaction menu but go to my satchel and i'll open up the citadel rock map um just make sure i had the right name because this was the first time i started doing it when i started collecting the gold and then you, once you open it up, it'll spawn in this area. Okay, the treasure hunter will not despawn. As long as you stay in this area, he'll stay here. Um, and you just need to find the locations of those maps. Now that little website that I showed you in the description, or you guys will have to download or use, um, you guys can see where the spawn locations are for the treasure itself. Okay, so you can collect it quite quick, quickly, sorry. So I've collected it. And from here, I'm going to go back over to make my way to the treasure hunter and collect the map. Now, the map that I'm going to collect this time will be the Citadel Rock again, okay, because that's the one we just opened up and used. Now, if you were just to kill this dude now and he won't give you treasure map if you didn't do this part where you open the map up and collect the gold because it'll just give you something random like a gold tooth or something like that. So this is why we use this as a glitch where we are collecting stuff, we kill him and re-get the map again. Right. So that's pretty much it for the video. Um, once you pick this map up, it'll be Citadel Rock, as you can see. And you just basically close up 
and then you go through the process again, change your month either back one month um, to the previous month or bring it back to the current month. And then you continue on, collect gold. Um, but yeah, just very important, once you come back online and if you still have that treasure map open that you haven't collected the treasure itself yet, just make sure the treasure hunter spawns in, reopen that map up, make sure it refreshes, then collect the treasure, then go back and see the treasure map hunter, dot the guy that you're getting the map off, and then you can basically um, continue the process. Okay, but if you don't do that in that process, um, especially if the map is open already, don't reopen it to refresh it you can stuff up and you'll have to wait again for this treasure hunter to spawn back in again so hopefully this has helped you guys I have been trying to find a decent way to do this glitch or respawning of the treasure hunter since it come out um, it was on seven sins ages ago it was for PC I couldn't get it to work on PC but I have no issues on PS4 um, sometimes the treasure hunter will just disappear okay and there's I don't know what causes that, but that has happened to me once, and I had to re-wait for the um, timing before the, I could see the treasure hunter again. So if that happens, you might just have to wait. Um, hopefully this works after the update. Um, I can't see it not working because of the fact of internet, and I can't really do too much without lagging internet unless they change their saves or whatever, but yeah. This, this should work after the update, but I will check it out after that happens, after I've had time to suss the update out, and if there's anything happens with that, you guys will be seeing it on our channel. But um, that's pretty much it for the video. Um, hope you enjoyed it. Stay tuned. We'll have more content soon. Thanks again to all your subscribers and especially the channel members. You guys rock. All right. Thanks again. See you in the next one.